Hello and welcome back to another Traria Guide video. I'm Scalelord and today we're going to be going over how to make the Void Bag and Void Vault in Terraria. If you are familiar with the Piggy Bank, then this is basically an other separate storage system. The Void Vault and Void Bag share storage space the same way the Piggy Bank and Piggy Trough do as well. It also doesn't share storage space with the Piggy Bank, which will significantly increase your inventory space before going into hard mode. There are only really two main requirements to gather the ingredients for the Void Bag or the Void Vault. First, you must farm the Eater of Worlds or the Brain of Cthulhu, and second, you must have defeated Skeletron in your world to have access into your dungeon. Once these requirements have been met, it is rather simple. First, you must go down into the dungeon and farm the skeletons for their bones. You will need exactly 45 bones to make one bag and one vault. Next, you'll need to go down into the underground jungle biome, and you'll need to search for jungle spores. These are green plants that will have a faint green aura in the background. You will need to have 28 of these for one bag and one vault. Then farm either either the Brain of Cthulhu or the Eater of Worlds until you have 45 shadow scales or tissue samples. This will give you the exact amount that you will need for one bag and one vault. Now, assuming you have all your materials, you will need to go to a Demon or Crimson altar in your world. These are generally found inside the Corruption or Crimson Caves, but they can also be found deep underground in the cavern layers of your world as well. Now combine the materials and make your Void Bag and Void Vault. Your Void Vault will be placed anywhere you like, and this will act as a chest wood. While the Void Bag will work identical as the Money Trough did as a portal chest. Keep in mind that this does not replace your piggy bank, but it will only add additional space. If this video helped, then make sure to like and subscribe and join my Discord. Make sure to check out my merchandise tab here on YouTube. I have three more videos that you guys should watch and it'll really help you meet the requirements to this as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.